Welcome to my channel, Planet with Maserati and Scripture Writing by Honey. We are going to be doing day four of the daily scripture writing. Let me change my pen. Which is Exodus 13, 20 through 22. I'm going to go ahead and mark it off. So before I begin, I'd like to tell everybody welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell. If you miss out on any new videos, please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So with that all being said, um, you can find a list in the description below. There will be a card either later on today or tomorrow and up on top. And you can find the list at swtblessings.com. So let's begin. We're going to focus the month of September. God can make a way. So I already had set it up. I am using 2J. I cannot even tell you what pen this is, but it's a really pretty pen. I, and I think maybe Dollar Tree? I'm not too sure. I don't even remember. Okay, so let's read the Bible. I already have the Bible set up. It's 13, 20. So it's this one little paragraph. It's very small, very fast. And it says, after leaving... Sukkoth, Sukkoth, they camped at Etham on the edge of the desert. By day the Lord went ahead of them in a pillar of a cloud, of cloud to guide them on their way, and by night in a pillar of fire to give them light, so that they could travel by day or night. Neither the pillow, pillar of cloud by day, nor the pillar pillar of fire by night left its place in front of the people. It's kind of funny is because I'm trying to say pillow because it's P-I-L-L -L, and I'm looking at it like pillow and it's really pillar. So that threw me off there. So how is everybody's scripture reading? I'm going to leave the Bible just like this just in case you want to see it. And this is the NIV version. Um, it's probably in the way. And yeah, so how's everybody's night doing? I am late at doing this. I just wanted to rest today. I don't know why. I just felt the need to just watch TV. Which is kind of crazy because I am not the type to watch that much TV. And man, did I watch it. So I watched, um, there's a show called Chicago PD. I love that show. It just cracks me up. The things that the police officers say and do is so funny. As far as, like, one of the ladies were new to the unit. You know, she knows the people and everything like that. She was a police officer. But they go into special intelligence. And when they did that, when she did it, and it was her first day, they had a shooting. And what was hilarious is she's like, do you want me to go upstairs? And the police officer, the special intelligence that runs it, was like, do you see them shooting up there? It was just so, so hilarious. But we're for the scripture reading. So how is everybody and how is your scripture going along I am on time as far as writing the scriptures out. Um, I'm one day behind on posting it. And again, the internet is running like extremely slow. And that is another reason I, you know, sat back and just relaxed today. Because I feel like my body was calling for relaxation. Like it's saying slow down or something. And maybe just relax and watch a little TV. But I really don't like to do that. I honestly don't. I love to get my scripture rating out. But I did do this. You know, I actually filmed it on the day. I actually did everything it needed to be done. It was just the internet. It's like running very slow. And I feel bad. It's not out that day, but you'll have two tonight, hopefully, because I'm still, since 3 o'clock this afternoon, uploading, no, not 3, I'm sorry, 5 o'clock this evening, 
I've been waiting for one video just to upload. That's a 20 minute video. I normally don't have that long, you know, where I have to wait that long. Because I would get four or five videos out a day. And it's hard to pull two because of the internet. I don't know what is on Metro's behind because they are like slowing down everybody's speed. Like if we don't need it or something, I don't know. So that's a little stressful, but yeah. It felt good to relax though. Just to sit back, we had Chinese food today and I am not one for Chinese food. I guess with all the hype about rats and cats and I'm not one for it. And I mean, it was really good today. I do have to say it was really good. And all I do is get vegetable fried rice anyway. I'm not really fond of meat. I'll cook meat. You know, I eat meat as well. I'm not a vegetarian. I wish I was. But I'm not. I don't know if I could, like, give up beef and gyros. Things like that. Like, chicken, I could give up. That wouldn't be no problem. But it's just, like, I don't know. The good food, I guess. <laughs> What did I just do here? Neither the pillar of cloud by day. I, I don't even know why I put... Let me fix this real quick. I'm going to show you a little trick um, to fix mistakes that you make. You just take old scrap paper. I mean, not paper. Old scrap stickers. See? I have a couple here. You just go by the size of what is here. I'm just going to cut a piece out. And these are the borders of the stickers. You see how it's got the cutout? Um, let's see here. Do you see the part of the sticker that was there? These are like scraps that I use. And it's my whiteout. It's my way of having a whiteout. Um, I know other people have done this in the past. It's not new. But... I mean, I love doing it. I hate using whiteout. And I don't like to use the word hate. But I do not like using whiteout. Now watch how fast this is to cover. Alright, I didn't cover it all. But just to show you an idea. Now I can actually do what I was doing. And it doesn't look too bad. I can even, to be honest with you, just grab another piece. And just cover that little piece of the bottom. You know what? I might just cover it all. Cover it back up. Because I didn't like the way it came out. So all I'm going to do is take a longer strip from the one that I showed you. And once I cover it, I won't. I'll show you in a second. what I'm going to do for the part that I do cover. So I'm going to cover this piece and I'm going to cut the piece that I don't need. See? So now that whole bottom is covered. And where I wrote, I'm going to cover it again. So it looks a lot neater than if you didn't have that. And you used white out. That's just a little trick. Sometimes you need to have these little tricks in your sleeve. I may have to go a little darker with it. There you go. Because of the bump. And it looks perfectly fine for me. And then I just move on. You don't have to do top layer, bottom layer. Like how I just did. But I wanted to cover up the part that I wrote again on. Or I could have just took the whole sticker off and redid it in the beginning. Like if I was doing it in the beginning. So yeah. That's a little tip. Just in case you have mistakes. You don't have uh, white out in front of you. But to me I think white out just gets messy. I don't know why I think that. But it just gets to me messy. <sighs> So, that is that. It's been a long, stressful... 
couple of weeks, but I think it's getting a little easier for me. I just got to face the fact my daughter moved out and get on with my life, right? So that is day four of the daily scripture writing. So I'm going to go ahead and upload it and hopefully by tonight you'll be able to see it. Oh, I don't know if I want to do this wash though. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm going to go ahead with it. Even though there's washi already down. Um, yeah, it's good. And another tip is if you're trying to like get a clean edge in the washi. You see what I'm doing? I'm holding the washi against... I'm holding the card against the washi. See? And just pull. And you got a clean edge. That's another tip. So yeah, so this is day four. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment. Share the video. That would be greatly appreciated. Let's put a little sticker down for day five. Um, if you're not subscribed, please do so. So you don't miss out on any new videos and hit that post notification bell. And if I said that already, I do apologize. I'm loving the fact that the scripture is not so long today. Or this month. It's pretty good. Last month was a lot of scripture. A lot of scripture writing, I should say. Not a lot of scriptures. It was a lot of scriptures, but yeah. And then I'll just write 13 down here. And then I'll just start writing. So, thank you for watching. Talk to you in the next one. Bye-bye.